Seem like it's filling up. How y'all doing? Yeah, it's me again. But you know what? I, I'm, I'm kind of offended. This Don, I don't know if y'all know who Dante is. The Dante Network. The Dante Network. Yeah, Dante over. They got this nigga on YouTube talking about you, Dante. Sucker. He's on YouTube talking about it. If he was locked up with me, he'll put me to sleep, all this stuff. I'll be his boy and all that. Listen to what I just said. The Dante show said, if I was locked up with, with fleece, I'll put him to bed. He'll be my boy. You know what that means? He's gay. Joe English, Village West, Louisville, Thug, 32nd Street Gang, checking in. Joe, what's up, Joe? Joe, what's up, my nigga? Thanks what's for the up? donation. Nigga, thank you, bro. My nigga. You know I'm going to slice this dude up, bro. Talking about if he was in penitentiary with me, he'll put me to sleep, all this stuff. His name is in front of Dante Network. And that I'll be his boy. Now, if you tell another man, if you was locked up with me, I will fuck you or whatever, what does that say about him? He's telling the whole world he's already gay. Why else would he desire another man? Especially a man like me. You know what? I take his cigar, nigga, and smash it right there in your goddamn mouth. That's what I do to you, Dante. Take his cigar. And make you swallow this motherfucker. If you was anywhere in a cell with me, you be, you know what you be doing? You be washing out my underwear, washing out my socks. Nigga, you'll cater to me, nigga. You'll cook my food. You'll, you'll put baby powder on my chest, punk nigga. That's what you'll do, nigga. Talking about you put me to sleep. Yeah, with some good head, nigga. I go to sleep after you, 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 you suck his Dante network. You know, you, this nigga keep messing with me because you know what? He got an interest in me. He thinks he, he wants my thing. That's what it is. He, it's, it's just what he calls. Well, I think this is Dante. Dante. Is that Dante? Talking about uh, put me to sleep. I'm, I'm gonna put you put you on speaker. We on live. Yeah, put him on speaker. Listen to this shit, Joe. Can you hear? Yeah. Now what you got to say to me, sucker? Hey, please, I've been looking for you. Looking for me? Here I am, nigga. I ain't hard as fan. What's up? Well, I think Are you laughing? Know. You think this is a goddamn joke, nigga? Hey, oh. No, nah, hold up my ass, man. You said you gonna put me to sleep. Ain't no apologies coming from me. I don't apologize. I'm gonna need for you to tone that down. No, nah, I ain't man. no tone shit down. I'm saying you said you gonna put me to sleep. What you gonna do? Give me some head? Hey, listen. No, nah, listen to nothing. <laughs> you gonna wash out my underwear. You gonna put baby powder on my chest, nigga. That's what you'll be doing. Now, first of all, we ain't gonna play these military mind games. Now, I ain't no military I'm mind game playing race. nothing. What you want with me, Dante? Now, you say you been looking games. for me. Now, I ain't no game to it. Are you looking for me? Oh, yeah, I'm looking for you. Well, you know, I'm no. live. I'm live, and everybody can hear you. The Dante Network is talking. Now, what you got to say? So, for the first act of business, I hope you got training. Because in the fall, it's going down. Okay. And hey, you know what? And I don't want to hear. Let me tell you. Let, let, no, no. Oh, wait, wait, shut wait, wait, shut wait, that big elephant mouth, mouth, nigga. Let me you shut that elephant mouth, mouth, nigga. Shut that elephant mouth. Let, let me tell you something, boy. No, nah, ain't no penitentiary rules, nothing, nigga. I live by, I, I violate rules. 
I don't go by no nobody rule. So I'm saying, okay, okay, Dante, let's let's make it real simple. Let's make it real simple. You got it. I'm not a hardy fan. I welcome you. I welcome you right here on this podium, brother. Oh, I, I'm gonna be down there. I you, I welcome you. You, you get right. I'm you not I'm you not going right. through all that, bro. I'm tactical fighter. I use strategy. Everybody I Please. fought, my hands down could have told me apart, but I'm a strategy fighter. And all that hook off the jab, that ain't going to work. Okay, man. I got all something. That hook off the jab, that ain't going to work. That's out. All right. What about a uh, punch to the throat, nigga? I mean, that ain't work. Ain't it work, won't it? Look, look. Whether you want to do MMA style ain't not. or boxing, it don't even matter. Look, all I want you to do is show up. Joe English already know I'm getting ready to do something. <laughs> Our people yeah. that know me from, from my city, they know when you show up. I'm going to get you in the buck, man. I'm going to get you right here. I don't want to hear no lawsuit or nothing. I'm going to get uh, you. I'm going to slam you on the ground throw your legs in the buck like I would hey. do. Now, I'm going to get you in the buck position, and I'm gonna, you ain't going to even be able to get out of it. Listen, and, 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 all these man, look, I'm going to get you in the – hey, what else could you want with me? Look, all these homosexuals. I still to give me some buck. Towards me. I ain't trying to hear none of that. Like I said, when I let said, me ask you a question, Dante. Do, it's gonna, it's, uh, it's, I'm going hands on immediately. Let me ask you this: Do you like girls with big butts? That ain't none of your nah, business. Nah, I'm not. It is my business, sucker. That ain't none of your business. And watch your mouth. Nah, I ain't, I ain't gonna watch gonna nothing. You, I ain't gonna tell you Look, again. Watch your mouth. Have you ever looked at your own butt? Listen, all these homosexual references that you keep coming up with, that ain't going to stay. Bruh, that's that the only thing I can think of. What man would want to be around another man except the man that wants him? Like you said, said you want me. Listen, like I said, penitentiary rules in full effect. Ain't no penitentiary rule, nigga. If it was, nigga, I, I would have you in a chokehold right now, nigga. Nah, but look, you. I don't I even take you before watch your mouth. Man, I'm not going to. Hey, you know what? Now, nah, now nah, you know what I'm getting. I'm getting sick of. You. I'm getting you, you. You kind of pinching my nerves. I'm trying to take you kind of lightly, but all that watch your mouth shit. No, I get to it. No, no, I get to it. All all right. I told you penitentiary rules and shit. Here, here, here's the deal. How you want to do it? Nah, I've been we we don't look, 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 Let's kill all this rap. Now. I'm just gonna talk to my fans. I'm telling you what. Show up. Y'all heard what he said. I ain't got no more rap. I'm going yeah, to take this sucker serious. Talking about pen and tinkers. See, see, if I'm running, you want me to come you to ducking? you? Why you ducking? Ducking nah, who? Down there. You ducking. I think he cute. For real. No, this is, no, no, see, I do. You, you got some big old thighs. You got big thighs. You got wide hips. You hey, got listen. wide hips. <laughs> Only thing you ain't got is me laying between your legs, nigga. Hey, listen, and I ain't listening, my head, nigga. Uh, listen. Talk about you ain't no homosexual. What you want, Joe? You want? want. This is foreplay to you, right? <laughs> I don't like. It. Oh yeah, this is foreplay. Yeah. This, this oh. Is. And hold on. And I'm guess what? Something. You talking about? You gonna take me to dinner and make sure I eat the whole? Oh meal yeah, that's what I do to suckers. That's what I do to suckers. Let me tell you, Joe. Take that serious. You yeah. step to me. I'm going to take you to lunch, and I'll make sure you eat the whole meal. No side yeah. dishes on me, nigga. Yeah. I'm going to get yeah. you food, nigga. Eat dessert. Eat yeah. dessert, too. Yeah, on Eat me. Dessert. You didn't like that phrase, did you? Hey, like I said. I, back, I backs it up. Way. I backs it that, up. That, I backs that it up. be the wrong way. Hey, listen, answer this for me. What's this, that? I'm going to tell you what the problem is. This is the problem. What's the problem, you know, I, just, I just felt like when that MSCNBC came out, you talking about, oh, if I see one, I like them. And I say, hey, come here. And we can do this the easy way and the hard way. If I was there, oh, you would have got put to bed immediately. What I do? I mean, I don't say. You think so? I know so. No. Uh -uh. Immediately. Right there on the yard. You wouldn't have been able to walk that yard. I would have been, been I would have been your best friend all the way up till I stuck this up in you. Then I would have no, been no, your you man. Would have been, you would have been holding my pocket. No, nah, no, nah, I'm just right telling you. I'm just telling you, me and you would have been real good friends. That's how I would have oh. I would have talked you out of it. 
I would have been your friend. I would have gave, made sure you you were straight. I would have had your back on everything. I would made sure you had food, all that. Talk to you every day, and and then uh, on your birthdays and holidays, I've been there for you. And then next thing you know, you be in my arms, boy. Man, fuck all the bullshit. Like nah, that. you See, know it. You was on the listen. Yard with you. If I was on the yard, you would not have been able to walk. You would. You would have been my there. friend, man. You would have been my best friend. You would have. You would have. You would have asked me for protection. Hey, listen. That's what you would have asked for protection. Hey, my record, hey, hey, check this out. My record, nineteen and oh, you gonna make it twenty? Don't even worry about it. Hey, you know what man is? Yeah. I don't even count them. Cause all that racker stuff that don't apply, bro. You done met somebody very skilled. I'm, I'm, I'm real skilled. Like when I meet you, I'm gonna tell you exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna talk nice to you, and you ain't gonna do shit. <laughs> I'm just telling you what you gonna do. I'm gonna talk nice to you, bless you, and walk up on you. And when I get in range, nigga, look out. It's gonna be all it takes is range, man. Once, once I, once I extend that range to see where my reach is, I know I'm quicker than you. Hey, listen, please. But I don't want to fight you. I want to, Dante. I want to love you. Because I know it's why you coming to me. You coming to me for love, bro. Listen, my bottom line is this. Your bottom, your bottom is what? Bottom line is this. Your bottom. You talking about your butt? You talking about your butt? You a bottom? So you saying you a bottom? I let you right in your eyes, sweet, and I see you. It ain't nothing for pussy there. Ah, uh, you going yeah. down. Yeah, you're it's right. It's going to be immediate. Imme when I see you, well, I'm going I'm I'm to get up on you real quick. And I'm gonna do I want you to get up on me. Get up on it, Joe. Get up on it, Dante. I'm going to do your bad. And all the homosexual records yeah. that you keep on throwing around, yeah. that's out. That's out. And yeah, it will. you'll be out with it. That's out. You're going to be out with it. How about that? Hands and feet gonna be activated. Yo, hey, 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 look, can you see me? Yeah, I can see you. You see that knuckle? Look, 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 look how big it is. Look at that big what one right, mean, right, right, right up. You know why it's, it's puffed up? You know why it's puffed up like that? I don't know, Tim. Ask the knuckle that for 30, 40 years, I used to pound, pound on the wall like that, knock all the calluses and all that out of it. I don't even feel, I ain't even got feeling in up. That's, that's the one, that's the knock off the jab knock. Look at it. Imagine that hit you. I'm telling you, man, it's like steel. I took my knuckle and beat it until it turned to steel. I can stick a, a pin in it, it won't even blood come out. It's like steel. That's the punch that they break shit. Look, let me show it to you again. Look how big it is. Look at it. Hold on. Hold up. What can the camera see? It? Is I'm doing hey, it right? Back up a little bit. Back hey, up. Right there. Let me lean it down. Look at look. Did you see it pumped up? Look at it. Look at look, nigga. Look at this. I need for you to orchestrate something for me. I don't need to orchestrate. I'm set. Bro. Hold, on, hold on for a minute. We gonna we gonna need we gonna need some paperwork done because when I put hands on them, I don't listen. I need for y'all to. Get the EMS on standby, call the morgue, call the hospital, and let them know that fleece coming. Yeah, yeah. you're right. He's going to let them know that I, I can't stop coming. Because that's what you're going to make see, me do. You're going to make me come. You're going to make me come. Well, Don, Dante, we, we'll get the paperwork together because you're going to need it. That's oh, right. You're you going to need it. You're going to be 19 and 1, Dante. <laughs> Man, you, I just saw, I just showed you my knuckle, bro. And that's not a horrible record, bro. That's not a horrible record. It's gonna be nineteen and one, though. No, I mean, every, I mean, Sugar Ray Leonard lost one. Mom and I, I mean, you know what? You know what? I mean, the people really want to know this. The people really want to know what my real issue with fleece is. It ain't that. Listen. I, I, it ain't that. I don't like fleece. No, I don't. I don't like. It's not that I don't like fleece at all. It's just I just I gotta do this. This is the booty warrior. Mm -hmm. Versus the blade pusher, right? This, this the is who? I, this is for this is blade pusher. Hey, hold up, man. <laughs> no, nah, look. Let me tell you something. Versus the you. blade pusher. That blade. See, man, 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 you talking? So you, you, you get me upset right now. Oh, well, well, get upset. Then. You, get me, get you, you, you get me upset. I'm, I'm get mad. No. 
And I would say I would knock your teeth out your mouth, but well. I keep saying these so Gong, gong and run your <laughs> run run your mouth, clam. You a clam. I lost my they took my teeth. I ain't lose shit. And you better be grateful for that. Now they took them be because be I bit, I was biting motherfuckers, nigga. Hey, I'm talking about I picked up outside charges for biting motherfuckers' ears, lips off, and all that shit. Nigga, I'm a monster. Bro, I wouldn't wish me on my worst enemy. Listen, I make a nightmare scream, nigga. Can you do that? It sounds good. I can make a nightmare scream. And I'm 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 going to show you something. See, your head is whore. You trying to get you some ratings. You get ready to get fucked up. (laughs) Nah, I'm taking your goddamn ass serious. You're going to get fucked up. Now, when you come here, I'm, I'm going to say, I'm taking you to the cleanest. I'm taking you to the cleanest. Boy. You're going to the cleanest. I'm going to hit you so hard, please. You're going to wait. You're going to be like, God damn, I think it's hard. Let me put it to you in the country term. You going to cook the cake with me, nigga. I'm going to eat it, too. I'm oh, yeah. Too. Yeah, you're going to eat that. Yeah, I'm going to make I, you I, eat I, it. I'm going to make you eat it. Let, let me ask no, you, you me a goddamn real. thing. I want, go you ahead. Real. I want you to be real, Freeze. All bullshit aside. So you really think that me and you was on the same yard together. If you would have came at me like that, you want to get knocked out? I wouldn't have came at you like that. You ain't listening. I would have came at you as a friend all the way up to I stick this up in your ass, right? <laughs> nah. Yeah, that's how I am. I'm not going to come at you straight no. up. I ain't gonna come at nobody straight up talking about people being old and all. I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna. I'm gonna talk you out of that, that butt, man. And that thing, let me tell you. And you cute too. You know who you look like? There you go with them homosexuals. No, you look like you look like that motherfucking Sasa Santana. That's who the fuck you look like. <laughs> hey, come on, chill out, man. Now you're taking this shit too far. You taking this shit too far you look like, I thought you were Sasa Santana when I first saw you, you. Now you making me mad now, please. Yeah, now man. you taking this shit too far. <laughs> you taking this shit too far now, big please. I might have to put hands on you too for that. Did, for did, you allowing him, for you allowing him to say some shit like that, big Lee. Well, look, 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 look. You too. Well, you, okay, you gonna run to me when you 19 and one though. <laughs> so you go, you gonna run two back to back? Come on, stop, Dante. Come on, Dante. Stop, Dante. You don't want to lose two in a row, man. This gonna be. Look, I like your little show and everything, so don't do that. He likes your show, man. I like your show, man. Don't, don't do that. Well, that's who I thought you were. I'm just saying, please, because you wouldn't have been able to wind and die me. I would have been extorting you. No, I would. I would have <laughs> let you think all that. No, I would have let you think, man. I would have let you do all that, you know, just to get get up in uh, inside of you. I let you, you See, know. They go with the homosexual references again. You cute. You making him nervous, man. Who making who nervous? You, you making him nervous, man. Fuck him. <laughs> no, fuck him, yeah, nigga. Fuck yeah, you, yeah, nigga. Yeah. Nigga, I hope yeah, I can yeah, make you nervous, nigga. Sit yeah. on my cock. Yeah. Sit on my yeah. cock, nigga. You that nervous? You. If I you nervous. Good. If you like nervous, if you nervous, my foot is already in the door, nigga. Hey, listen, you sound good saying that. You might even look good saying it too. <laughs> we gonna uh, we gonna hook it up, Dante. So, oh, it's, oh, it's definitely it. It's, we, it's on. Hey, please, it's up. It's up. Right, I'm gonna let I'm gonna let him finish his laugh and and like I said, send me the paperwork. Hey, yeah, seeing the paperwork, sucker. That's what you gonna be. Don't even worry about it. I got you. Don't, big don't, old running that big, big elephant mouth, nigga. <laughs> you sleep, you sleep easy. All right, man. Easy. All right. Big old elephant mouth, nigga. Shit. So y'all, my fans, y'all heard that shit. A motherfucker, he just, people want to keep trying me. I tell them, I came out of penitentiary, a changed man. You know, I want to live the normal life out of her. You know, be a citizen. Act like I got some sense. Work for a living. All it is. But here come all these old prison mentality people wanting to uh, take me back into the penitentiary shit. Uh, well, who is that? Let me see. Uh, Ozzy Hype donated. Ozzy Hype donated with a question. Said Hustle Spirit, is there a movie deal in the future for Fleece Johnson? It sure is. 
Thank you for asking. Yeah. We're definitely you. working on that. Yeah. Yeah, it is. And I hope somebody else got a question. Let me tell y'all what's going on, man. I'm doing good. You know, I'm trying to maintain, stay on the radar, watch TV, the news. And I'm saying over all these killings, man, our family killings is what I'm talking about. Family killing families. Kids, parents killing their kids, kids killing their parents. Uh, that shit is real, man. That's why I tell everybody, if you got a family member that's making threats, take them seriously. Tell them to get the fuck out. Call me. So who donated right here and what they see? Uh, uh, who was that uh, donated? Random boy. Random boy. So you have a Punish someone for getting booty, uh, getting duty on you. Hey, look, I don't mess with nobody that don't know how to do what they do. Them sisters in the penitentiary, they douche. Yeah, they clean themselves before they have sex. So if you stick something up in them, it ain't nothing but clean shit up in them. Oil and all that. Got another one from Official Rico Finesse. Uh, what they say? Thank you. He said, you going to have Dante singing like Luther Vandross. Pause. Man, Dante is a joke. Y'all already know I'm, hey, like I told him, I make a nightmare scream. Man, I chose to be good because I was so bad, man. I was so bad, I went to hell. I got a glimpse of it. So it changed my whole attitude about trying to keep an attitude. I know what an attitude leads to. So I drop it. So who is this? Hold on, let me see. Jay Reed, are you related to anyone in Covington ever been? Yeah, hey, Jay Reed. Uh, I spoke highly about Covington, man, about Santana. Uh, the white boys killed him in the grain, and his brothers came off the streets, came in the penitentiary, and sought me out. And they found out who killed their brother. I laid the thing out. They took care of business, went home. Much love for Covington, man. Stand up, stand up, city, man. Love yeah. they people there. Got another from R. Fox. R. Fox. Said, get your bro James, a.k.a. Body man on the show. Who's that? <clears throat> Your brother James. Is that what they talking about? Yeah, I got a brother named James. He said, "Get your brother James, aka Body Man, on the show." Hey, you know what? Watch what you say. What's wrong with that, Flea? Okay, give me another one. You don't want to comment on it? No, I think that person... I, I comment on it. Here's the thing about my brother, the body man. Here's the man, my brother. He came, he got out of the penitentiary. Uh, they gave him 30 days to get a job. He couldn't find one. My sister and them driving him around, took him to a... They won't stop at McDonald's. He jumped out, went to a body shop. Told him, man, I'll do anything for work, man. Told him, clean up. And then after about 10, 12 years, he's the best in there doing body work. Uh, he was the baddest thing on the street. And then he got hooked on some crack and all that stuff. I'm in prison. I'm hearing this shit. And so uh, he's skilled in everything, man. And uh, crack took him down. Then the last I heard, some somebody jumped on him and shot him. But he left me for dead in prison. But I still went to the rehab where he's at, talked to him, and uh, took him some money, brought him some stuff, you know. And I asked him, I said, who did this to you? They whooped him so bad, he, he don't even have a recollection of it. But... uh. Mm. 
Who's next? Got a uh, Laker hopeful. Hey, Fleece. Hey, Fleece. Sissy almost made me break. I feel weak. Ain't no such thing as almost make you break. Either you there or you ain't, right? If anything, the sissy almost brought out what you keep trying to hold on to. Is that what you're saying? Kick it out. We got Kamosa Jones. Fleece, have you guys seen my series that verifies your story and proves you aren't a predator? I would love for your react get your reaction. No, I ain't seen it, but I appreciate it. You know, I already know I'm not a predator. You know, everybody in my city know, everybody that's socialized with the name C.S. Johnson know I'm a fighter, and they know that the department that I went up against, I whooped them, and the system is out trying to get back that the system has arranged and orchestrated all this. Everybody knows it. Got Joe English donated again. What up? Joe, man, I'm just trying to stay positive, my bro. You know, you know how it is, nigga. But I ain't going to be like Snoop Dogg. If I do hit success, I will help my people. Got Travis Clark. Did you ever get your heart broken in the pen? Man, when you're in the pen, you ain't got a heart. The only way to survive in our, you tell people this. I give you whatever, but the only thing I keep is my heart. I tell ladies that. I give you everything else, but you ain't going to get my heart because you'll never get a chance to break it. Yeah, GP. GP. He said, please put your hands on Dante so he can be exposed. On a muscle, my nigga. On a muscle. I'm not, I don't, man, I don't play about all that, bro. It ain't no. Hollywood thing to me, nigga. I see you, nigga. You talk all that old trade on site, nigga. I'm gonna show you, you ain't shit. Nothing. Nature Simurai the third. Fleece, did you ever study Sigmund Freud in prison? Yeah, I studied that punk, man. I ain't like it. Sigmund Freud. I mean, here's somebody gonna break the atom, go to a mother creator out a bomb that destroy the whole world. They go to his thing. And everybody stand up, give him a clap, a uh, standing ovation. Well, I'm going to give a standing ovation to a crazy motherfucker. A motherfucker that created a bomb that can kill everything. You can fuck him, kill him. That's what they should have did. Spin on his grave. Joe English donated again. He said, I keep hearing about your YouTube come up. Yeah, Joe, this shit right here was necessary. I really didn't even want to get on here, man. Mother kept talking trash. He's a raper, all that shit. I'm you know, a bunch of made up shit, man. And uh, my agent said, man, I, I can give you opportunity to speak out. So I said, I want that, bro. Because it ain't me. Yeah, everybody know it from the city, bro. Got one from Dwight Howard. Dwight Howard. Fleece, I know you like me and I know I, I know you want me. Dwight <laughs> Howard, I hope you the basketball player. Hold on, he said, I will. I, hold on. Is that the basketball player? Hold on, it's flipped on me. Wait a minute. No, I'm pretty sure it's not. I want it rough and hard the hard way. The choice has been made, Daddy. Let me tell you, tell you something. I made this statement one time, I'll do it again. I take the ugliest woman out of here with one leg, one eye, and no mouth over any pretty man. In the world. I ain't, I'm on the streets. All that penitentiary stuff, it stays in penitentiary. You know, I grew up in there. So, you know. You feel like sp spitting a freestyle today? Because young Johnny D said spit a freestyle about Dante and Nate Boone. Okay, it's a freestyle. About Dante and Nate Boone. Yeah, about Dante and Nate Boone. Two assholes in the same room, talking trash, both and kiss my ass. Dante come to me with this shit. What he really want to suck my dick. Boom running his mouth. I done already called him out. You crap. That's enough. Don't give him too much. They're going to record it. 
All right, we got Lex Henderson. Get fleece on Kendra G to find a lady. I don't even I don't even know who Ken, Kendra G is. Maybe you do. I, I don't either, but I tell you what, I wish I could. God know I'm a good man. I just need a good woman, man. I somebody like to get treat right, respect, spoil, all of that. Just a good, sweet, honest woman. And then we got KD. KD. Look, Fleece, we tired of you telling us to read the book. I'm going to tell you like this. I want you. I need you. My balls are heavy. Nigga in my fleece voice. LOL. Look, let me tell you something. I don't give a fuck what you want, what you see, what you think you got to have. But when it comes to me, I make a goddamn decision. All right. Joe English, he said, buying cars and clothes, but won't pay debt debt to me. Do what now, Joe? He said, you buying cars and clothes, but you won't pay you won't pay him his money. Come on, Joe. You know I don't owe you nothing, man. Now you get ready to start some silly shit now. You get ready to start some silly shit. We got the official Rico Finesse. Fleece, how many siblings do you have and are they still living? Yeah, I have three. I had three brothers and three sisters. One of my brothers killed himself. And uh, one of my sisters died uh, of AIDS. And uh, I got two brothers left and two sisters. And we don't speak. And that's the reason why I read my book. All right, Joe English, he's still shooting at you. He said, who, who set you up in Eddieville with Contra? Me, nigga. Look, Joe. Contra, I don't even know all that terminology and all that shit. Ain't nobody set me up with shit. I did my own setting up my thing. And he said not to mention a half ounce of dope in front of you. And he in front of me shit. I'm the one that people, I was in the hole, and you got people on the yard getting in trouble to come to the hole to get weed off of me. That's how much weed I had. I had, I'm the only one that had it. Got one from Chris Brown. Did somebody ever smack you on the back of your head in prison? Did you ever fart in front of people in jail? Hey, you know what? I wish I could grab you with one hand, this hand right here, and choke you for a minute and make you not speak the way you just spoke to me, sucker. Got okay, cool breeze. What ended up happening to Lieutenant Cal? Man, I don't know what happened to Lieutenant Cal. He killed, look, we went to Warner, this big black 300 pound guard. He killed an inmate, you know, that, and white people had in sight that he went and killed his inmate. And uh, he lived in Hop Town. That's where he lived at, punk. I tore him up, though. I tore him up and poked through shit in his face. <laughs> yeah, Kenneth Lamont X. <laughs> Fleece, you should call the into the Kendra G show. Your DMs will be full. And fleece, they coming at you because they think you too old. They can think what they want to think, man. You know what I'm saying? It ain't that I'm too old. They coming at me because I know too goddamn much. That's why. Got one from uh, EJ the Don five thirty one. Thank you. Said, uh, "Are you able to get a passport? You can get veneers." For a thousand dollars in the Dominican Republic, I can get what? Veneers. Oh, hey, look, you want to crack jokes? Let me give you one. I know where you can get a job too in a cookie factory, sticking your head in that dough, making fucking giraffe cookies, giraffe looking motherfucker. How about that? 
The next one is uh, uh, Jairaya, I guess that's what it is. Say, hey, Linda, did you miss me? <laughs> I'm going to kick his motherfucker's ass. You know what? Fuck you. All right? How about that? <laughs> Got a fish of Rico Finesse. Say, have you ever ran into the big man that punched a hole in the wall later in life? He did. Dead. And you know how too, don't you? See, now nah, my agency don't even talk, man. I was getting ready. Ooh. Got one from Joe English. You owe me, fleece. Me. Joe. Hey man, keep the love, bro. You my nigga, be my nigga, man. Don't don't come out of here doing this shit, bro. Stay my nigga now. Kamosis Jones, the one that's writing the documentary that shows your innocence, said, what happened in 1988? Say I have three ride over a fan. That will be in my book. That's too much detail. I know exactly what happened. But it wasn't over a goddamn fan. Who else is that? Joe English again. He said, I fronted you when you came home to get on your feet. When I came home, it was only one person in my corner, Joe. Her name is Treva Spouting. She lives in Atlanta now, but she's back here in Louisville. Treva looked out for me, bro. Showed it from day one, nobody else. Treva. You got about 12 more minutes. Okay, and from Trevor, I met, I left Louisville. I done did all this time, and, and the system is out, out to get me. They trying to take all my jobs. I had a job making 26 an hour. I was a supervisor. I ran a complex. I was a machine operator. They took my job because I'm still on parole. So I said, you know what? I called 911 and said, man, I want to go back to prison. And I forced my way back, did a year, went through programs, came out off parole. That's how hard I am, nigga. That's how hard I am. And Cool Breeze, he already answered that question. What ended up happening to Lieutenant Cal? Man... I heard conflicting story. I don't know if he's dead or what, but if he did, good. That's right, good. You got Craig Sapp, you're an urban legend. Stay up, bro. Hey, I am what I am. Got another from Grizzly Music Records. He said, Can you wish my brother and my big sis, my my brother and big Lisa a happy anniversary? Yeah, happy anniversary to him. Yeah. Hope you don't have none of me. Joe English again. He said, don't make me tell about you and the guard named Gil. Only thing you can talk about Gil is I whooped the one down at Eddieville, and when I was sent to no, I mean, whooped the lucky. His brother, I whooped him with a chair. Whooped his secretary, threw her out in the hallway, ripped the dress off of her, and all them dudes standing around, they ran and I threw a sheet over her head. They did what they did. But I whooped his brother. I whooped guards, bro. I whooped a lot of them. Said so Jay Reed, did you expect your internet fame when you got out? Is it more of a blessing or a curse? The church rejected you, but the internet embraces you. Ain't no church. Uh, one church rejected me. Now, the church that I'm really a part of, I don't mention their name. It's one of the best black churches in the state. I was baptized there. I ain't been in church in a while, but my pastor has taught me a lot. Did you expect your internet fame to have internet? Fame when you got out? 
No, I wasn't expecting none of that. I wasn't even looking at fame. I was looking to defend this allegation that I was a rapist. I ain't no rapist, bro. That ain't even nowhere possible that I could even even come to that. That came from my enemies, the the correction cabinet, the retaliation. Again, Nature Simurad the third. Fleece, have you ever wondered where sound come from? Who? Sound. Now let me tell you about sound. Since you want to mention sound, I'll show you something else that I'm smart in. Where do you think the word Ku Klux Klan came from? A sound, the cocking of a rifle. <coughs> That's what the Ku Klux Klan, yeah, I know a lot about sound. Got one from uh, Jairaya. You went back to prison because you missed my uncle. Who? Hey, you know what? Look, nigga. Nah, I just go on, go on somewhere. Oh. Kamosis Jones, this guy writing a documentary for against himself to prove you innocent. What happened in 1985 when you robbed a hundred dollars and why? I have no idea what you're talking about. How about that? I'm not gonna admit to no robberies that I don't really don't even know nothing about. Them. Maybe you're trying to get me killed with a robbery. Mr. O, how you refrain from slapping people now that you're a civilian again? Look, I don't slap nobody. You know, I've been slapped, but the people that slapped me got whooped. They slapped the wrong person. I don't do no slapping. I don't like bullies. I don't like none of that. Yeah, Joe English again. You know me and you know my history. Don't play. Joe, fuck your history and fuck you. How about that? Play with that, nigga. I'm sick of your shit. Got the sizzle guy donated. Keep grinding, fleece. Straight support from Colorado. Colorado, man. I ain't never been nowhere, man, but I used to. When I was in prison, I used to read books, magazines, and Colorado was one place I wish I could someday go see, man. Thank y'all. Got one from Random Boy. Said, uh, were there any legendary butt men like Harden? Man, they got the prison that I was in had a walk with about 150 inmates on it that they locked up because they was, they the butt guys. The guys that walk around, jack off on everybody, jack off on anybody. They come in the shower while you taking a shower and all of them in there stroking their dick. And you in there trying to wash up. And yeah, they gonna get you. Everybody get jacked off on in there. I don't give a fuck how tough you are. Some of them gonna jack off on you. It's crazy, man. Straight drop, straight drop donated. Linda Dynamite, stop ducking that Nate Boone fade. Let me tell you something. You know, I can take the bitter with the sweet, you know, even with the criticism with the positivism. So keep on rocking. You got a word from CJ Lee. My wife says she loves cornflakes. Thanks, fleece. Oh, yeah. Some girls feel like, you know, that's an insult. Kind of like dinner and serve a cornflakes. <clears throat> I mean, who are you? We're not going to ask that question, Joe English. What do you uh, say? We're not going to ask it. Mm -hmm. Got Jairaya. Nate Boone would have had you washing his drawers and socks. Let me tell you something. I told you I don't like booties. Bullies, and I don't like nobody that 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 kill their own can. I I I, I look, it's it's ridiculous. The only thing they boom would have did is, 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 is made me check him the fuck off the yard where he can't even come out of his cell. I would have put him in that situation. We got a random girliness eighty six. 
Do you like younger women? I'm 38. I like women in general. You know, the age don't matter. It's the maturity of the woman. A oh, man, you know, if she, she if she's mature, yeah, I could enjoy. Yes, I could. I can do all the things a young person does. You know, I'm still got that young spirit in me. I dance, I play sports, I walk, I like to move around, I clean, do dishes, I cook. I do a lot of things, right? Yeah, I could enjoy you, baby. Sweet. Got one from Kenneth Lamont X. Kenneth Lamont X. When your wife scratched your face, what did you do to her? I ain't do nothing. I talked to her. And even today, even though me and my wife is broke up, just today, I just brought her some skillets, bowls, and plates, and garbage bags at the house yeah. she's staying in now. I sent her $100. Uh, I paid a phone bill. Uh, but we just can't get back together. But I would never trash her. I ain't going to trash no woman, man. I mean, if you got a problem that causes us to break up, I'll still be your friend if you let me. Got the last one from John Barry. John Barry. Fleece, you should travel and come to Thailand, bro. Come to where? Thailand. Thailand? Yeah. Man, I read a lot about Thailand. I take a pack of cigarettes over and be rich. I know what talent get. Thank y'all and I love y'all. Peace out. Oh, by the way, would you see me smoking? Yeah, that's what's up. Working on a deal, so we can't say the name brand right now, but thank you. Yeah, look at this sucker, boy. So what